Hey everybody, welcome to Now in Nature. This week we're talking about painted turtles. Painted turtles are the most common turtle in Minnesota. They get their name from the red, orange, and yellow stripes in their neck, head, and tail. It looks like an artist painted them. They are also called mud turtles, probably because they love to live in ponds, lakes, marshes, and slow-moving rivers with muddy bottoms. The average size of painted turtles are between 4 and 10 inches. They have a smooth shell, and as we heard, they look like they have been painted and are brightly marked. Their upper shells are relatively flat, with red and yellow markings on a black or greenish brown background. The shell of a painted turtle is made up of 13 bone plates. Those plates, they're called scutes, and a painted turtle sheds the outside layer of scutes as they grow. Painted turtles are omnivores. That means they eat both plants and animals. They mainly eat small fish, crustaceans, and aquatic insects while they are young. And as they get older, they eat more plants and vegetables. Though painted turtles don't have teeth. But don't worry, they can still eat their food. They have horny plates on their jaws that are like rough sandpaper. And these help them grip their food. Not all turtles love to live in water, such as the box turtles. But painted turtles are aquatic turtles, meaning they spend their days in water. You can find painted turtles in ponds, lakes, marshes, swamps, and slow-moving rivers throughout the entire North American continent. And as we heard earlier, they do love their muddy bottoms. Painted turtles will hibernate. Hibernation is a way for many creatures to survive cold, dark winters without having to go look for food or migrate to somewhere warmer. Most painted turtles hibernate at the bottom of ponds and lakes, holding their breath all winter. How long can you hold your breath? Speaking of holding our breath, did you know that painted turtles sleep at the bottom of the ponds and lakes at night? As they sleep at night and are active during the day, they are called diurnal. Painted turtles do come out of the water to bask, though. This is where they spend time in the sun. It helps them get rid of parasitic leeches and harmful bacteria and digest their food. They often sit on top of each other. Researchers have seen as many as 50 turtles on one log, all stacked on top of each other. Since they are small, they do need to keep an eye out for predators. They'll seek refuge in the water at the first sign of danger, and they can quickly retract their head and legs into their hard shell. Here's some last cool facts about these cold-blooded reptiles. You can count the rings on the painted turtle to see its age, just like a tree. They can swim underwater really well. They have to eat in the water because they need the water to help them swallow and chew their food. And a group of turtles is called a bale of turtles. Thanks for joining us on Now in Nature, brought to you by Springbrook Nature Center.